Hi, and welcome to the tutorial video of the preflop charts of PO Low Brain. This is the English version, and I'm going to try my best uh, to explain it in English. <laughs> As you can see, you have the charts here. These are the charts for uh, low stakes PLO, 100 big blinds. Here at the right, uh, you have the, the chart, the rake structure. Uh, in this case, PLO 50, 6 max, rake 50% uh, for BB cap. And here you have uh, the sizings uh, utilized for these uh, charts. It's a uh, raised 15 pot, 3 bed pot, 4 bed pot, etc. Here is a little explanation about uh, what means uh, every uh, square when you open a raised 15 chart. Uh, you can see that there is two squares, one on the top, another on the bottom. Uh, the top one uh, always means when you are out of position, and the bottom when you are in position. Uh, this is an exception when you are in the big plane against the small line, this, this chart right here. Uh, the top is when you, you have to free bet against the small line, and the bottom uh, means that uh, it's uh, against a limp in the small line. Here you can access all the charts from PLO Brain if you have purchased uh, more than one. In this case, I have everything we have at the moment. Uh, you can see 100 big blind low stakes, uh, 100 mid stakes. You can click it here and it goes to this, this other chart. And uh, 50 big blind uh, high, high stakes. In the future, we are planning to add uh, more charts and exploitative approach plus the PLO Atlas that is a document that we are uh, making in, in our poker school. First, I'm going to explain uh, how to organize all the charts. Here you have all the colors and the, the meaning of them. And then you have all the charts in different rows. This row, this, this from here, are the race first things. Early position, middle position, cutoff and bottom, when you have the option to open or fold your hand. Here you have the small line. Uh, when everybody falls and you are in the small line, when the early position player opens and you are in the small line, MP opens and you are in the small line, cut off and bottom. Here you have the big blind against small line, big blind against early position, big blind against middle position, big blind against cut off and big blind against the bottom. Finally, uh, here you have uh, how are we going to play when we are in position. Uh, you have middle position against uh, EP player, cut off versus MP, uh, bottom versus EP, MP and cut off. Here uh, you have uh, links for the uh, tutorial videos, uh, such as your, the one you are uh, watching right now, and a little bit of information about uh, if you can do or not uh, use these charts when you are playing in different sites. This video tutorial is for the version 1 of the lowest stakes charts and for the version 5.0 of the middle stakes uh, charts. If you are watching this video in the future, it's probably that we are updating these charts, so take notice of that. All the boxes have the same structure. In the first column, you have all the different kind of hands that you can have in PLO. In the rest columns, you have the suitedness of the, of the hand. It means uh, double suited hands, single suited hands, triple suited hands, this is new in this version, and uh, rainbow hands. From here to the top, you have all the hands that have or can have a pair on the hand, or two pairs like this one. From here to here, all the hands that doesn't have a pair. And here are the randoms. Uh, just a quick look. If you want to see a hand like imagine Queen Queen 7 6 single suited, you can go to this, this row, Queen Queen, single suited, and you can po point click here and you got all the hands. Here you can see that Queen Queen 7 6 early position, it's full in this stack. Don't worry because now I will show you uh, what the different colors means. From the top to the bottom, I'm going to teach you uh, what this means. Uh, here are all the hands that has uh, two aces on the hand. All the kings, all the queens, all the jacks, all the tens. Here, APP means uh, one ace with a pocket pair lower than 10-10. Ten, ten. BPP means uh, Broadway with a pocket pair lower than a 10, uh, a hand such as uh, queen 995. PP means uh, all the pocket pairs lower than 10-10. Ten, ten. Now, has to have a Broadway or an ace, hands such as uh, 998. Uh, five, for example. Uh, RROO means uh, double pairs in the hand, like uh, Jack Jack 55 five or 9933, for example. And now we have all the hands that doesn't have a pair, like ABB means Ace Broke with Broadway, a hand like Ace Jack 10X. Ace Broadway means uh, a hand like which uh, which has an Ace and a Broadway and two middle or low cards, uh, Ace Queen 
5.3, for example. And Ace, Ace a hand that hasn't have any more broadways. is Ace 6.5.3, for example. BBB is three broadways and a dangler. BB is two broadways and a dangler. Uh, Jack 10, 8, 5, for example. Broadway is a hand that has a broadway and three middle or low cards. And the randoms are hands organized in a way that you can see it in a bit with the difference between gaps in the hand. Uh, here you can find hands that are in this category and some of it here. You can choose wherever you want to look for them, but I can show you. Uh, here you can see uh, all the zero gap hands, hands, one gap hands, one one gap hands, uh, triple gap, two gaps, and one gap, two gap hands. This means uh, all consecutive hands, uh, all hands with one gap in the, in the hand. A hand such as uh, Ace, uh, Queen, Jack, Nine, you can look for it here in the rundowns or here in the Ace, Broadway, Broadway. As you can see, uh, you got the, ha the hand in, the, in, both, in both sides. Now we are going to explain uh, how the color code works. As you can see in the Race 15 uh, charts, uh, you have two blocks, no? one in the top and one in the bottom. All the colored hands uh, means that you have to open it in this position. In this case, uh, all these kings, single suited, are opens, or, or any color. The color is going to show you uh, how you are going to react to the next aggression. Usually all the red colors are going to be aggression plus fault. In this case, we open and against more aggression, I mean against rivet, we are going to fault. And yellow means uh, we are going to call. The difference in tonality are going to show us the frequency. These other colors are going to mean special occasions, uh, usually more aggression for our part. Here we have uh, Ace King King. We are going to open all Ace King King. But when we are facing a three bet and we are out of position, we are calling all the ye darker yellows. The more clean yellows, this one, we are going to call only with Ace High Flash color. For example, Ace King King 7 with Ace High Flash, we are going to call against the, against the three bet. And Ace King King 7 with King High Flash, we are going to fall against the three bet. With the red ones, we are going to open and against a three bet, when we are out of position, we are going to fall, all of them. The light red, we are going to open only when we have the, the high flash. You can see King, King, Jack, Five with King, High, Flash, we are going to open. King, King, Jack, Five with Jack, High, Flash, we are not going to open, we just fall. When we open King, King, Jack, Five, uh, King, High, Flash, and we get three bet against uh, play on the bottom, we have to fall. As you can see, when we are half position, we are calling much more when we are out of position. The blue color means that we are making uh, the next aggression every time we get aggression in the part of our opponent. You can see here, uh, you can see aggression 100%. It means we are opening our hand. Plus, raised 100%. It means when we face a three bet, we are making another ag aggression against that movement every time. So four bet all of them. The yellow ones, we are making an open as 100% aggression in our part. When we are facing a three bet, we are calling 100%. The lighter yellow means uh, we are open 100%. Against a three bet, we are just calling 50% of those combos, around more or less 50%. And in this case, we are going to call with a high, a high flash. If there is not an A high flash hand, and it's, uh, for example, a king or a queen high flash hand, this means we are going to call only with the, with the high car uh, flash. The lighter yellow means we are only opening 50% of those combos, the high card flash, and we are calling all of them. With the red, it's similar. We open all of them and we fold in all of them. The lighter red means we are only opening the high card flash and we are folding 100% of these combos. With the blue color, the normal blue is 100% raise, 100% forward. And the light color, we are opening all of them and we are only forbetting uh, the high card flash. We can take a look at more examples. We have here, for example, ABB, which means Ace Broadway with Broadway. As you can see, out of position, we are folding much more when, than when we are in position. All the lighter reds are opening only with Ace High Car Flash and folding to the three red. The darker red, we are opening all of them and folding all of them. The light yellow or middle light yellow, we are opening all of them, but, but we are just calling the three red uh, with these ones. The lighter yellow, we are only opening with ace high car flush, and we are calling all of them against the three bet. 
Here you can see uh, more uh, examples of this. And now we are going to teach you which means uh, the special colors, the purple ones. For this, we are going to see the cutoff range. When we are open on the cutoff and we have, uh, for example, kings, single suited, and we open and we face a three bet uh, and we are out of position, it means a uh, button three bet us, uh, we have a lot of purple colors. The darker purple means that we are opening all of the of these kings, in this case, ace king king, we are opening all of them. And against a three bet, we are only four betting 50% of them, and in this case, uh, with the king high flush. It, it means the lower flush. And when the, the opponent is going all in and making the five bet, we are folding all of them. For example, if we have ace king king seven with ace high flush, we open, and against the three bet of the button, we are just calling. If we have ace king king seven with king high flush, we open, and against the three bet from the button, we are four betting. If the player goes all in, we should fall. The lighter purple, this one, means that we are opening all of the combos. We are forbidding all of the combos, but we but we are falling the king high flush. Uh, for example, we have ace king king ten, ace high flush. We open against the three bet. We forbid against the all in. We are going all in with the ace high flush. We fold in the king high flush. As you can see, it's very easy. At last, uh, the black one color is similar to these ones, but we are opening all of them, we are forbidding all of them, and we are folding all of them. You can see uh, here, for example, Ace King King 10 Rainbow, we open against a 3-bet, we forbid, and against the Olin, we have to fold. We left to the to the end the, the, the more easy ones to learn, that is the, the calls, is the green ones. Uh, of course, we have no call because we don't limp in, in our strategy in, in in our open, so we have to go to, to our defend in big blind. Uh, you can see, for example, big blind against early position. Uh, in green, you have the calls. This means our uh, defense frequency. Uh, you can see all the dark green is that our hands that we are calling with 100% of frequency. And when we have uh, the lighter green, we are only calling with the high card flash. Last but not least, uh, we have the, the imposition strategy. Here we can see uh, how this is going to to translate from the race 16s to the the second option when someone is opening and we have the option to do a three bet call uh, or fall. Uh, we can see how are we going to play our kings, for example. As you can see, all the greens are going to be calls. Uh, the darker greens we are going to call all of them. The lighter greens we are only calling with high card flash, and uh, the red and the purple are going to be three bets. The red ones, we have to 3-bet all of them, and against the 4-bet, we have to fold all of them. And the purple, uh, we have to 3-bet only when we have the king high flash, and we are folding against more aggression. When we have the same combo, but with, with the ace high flash, uh, we just call. I hope that this is this video has been helpful for you and to understand the charts, and I hope that you will find uh, these charts uh, very helpful. Uh, sorry about my English, but this is uh, all for, for now. And I wish you very good luck at the tables. Uh, bye bye.